And, you know, and when I was talking to me once, I was talking about how love is we how much we're supposed to understand the idea of love is how much we are no we supposed to, to not think it's about us but thinking it's about others pretty much and God led me to go to the first Corinthians um 13 and 4 and 8 uh that God's definition of love um, uh, scripture that he desire us to perform concerning if you are of him this is the ideal performance of love is expected for those that truly follow him and as we understand in John, 1 John God is love you know and the topic of this message um, it is the Three H Nation scripture of First Corinthians four thirteen through four and eight. You know the uh, uh, is is pretty much more likely. Are we truly examining our love performance? You know, well, the reality of examining our God. God's love performance. You know what I'm saying? Examining the God's love performance. Not making up our own idea of love, but, you know, examining God's love performance because if we are true Christians, we will be performing in His idea of love. You know, that's what we will be doing. So, as we know, it, the uh, uh, the topic of the I mean the scripture is love is patient. I mean it says love. I got the a uh, new uh, King James version. I don't do NIV as well, but I could do new King James version. Um, it goes love suffers long and kind, not envy not parade itself is not puffed up is not seeking its own and not provoked and thinks no evil does not rejoice in iniquity but rejoice in the truth love beareth here comes the ALL y'all all things believe it all things endure all things love never fails but i'm gonna talk about you know that what's important concerning i was talking about concerning the me monster um about the first the the what paul talks first talks about it's quite interesting because what he first talks about well he, he told first he says love suffers long and kind or more like we say love is patient love is kind but watch what he talks about is like not envy, not parades itself, is not puffed up, behave does not be behave rudely, not seeketh his own self. Th those things are uh, characteristics of not have pride, pretty much, or more likely not have pride or arrogance. You know what I'm saying? Is what really characteristics really comes out in these uh scenario of 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 not parades itself is not puffed up be not behave rudely is not seek its own self those are those characteristics of pride that really about feeding the me monster greatly and the thing is it's it's sad concerning the state of of first of all the church system and the ideal of Christianity that you know the influence that is not is going on the influence is going on in churches in Christianity in how preaching you know preachers and teachers I mean per, perceive love and how much what what 
what's going on is what I'm kind of trying to say. It's like, you know, this performance, this love, this 1 Corinthians uh, 13, 4 through 8 love performance is not an ideal performance. it's not an ideal um, characteristics that is strongly done d- these days concerning Christians. I mean, I mean the ideal of you know, uh, love is patient, love is kind, and you know it's like you you see certain you meet you know. I mean, everybody's trying to grow and they're trying to uh, improve. In their walk with God and their love walk and everything else, I understand that. But I notice being around uh, the Christians and in our uh, image as Christians, that we, when we when we get go through this list, these things are not. And what's going on in around influence, the influence that's going around the country concerning a lot of things that uh concerning the president trump and or uh you know the racial tensions and you know this i mean we should as if if we do have the love of god that's according to first corinthians 13 and 4 through 8 should should speak out concerning our, our how we supposed to define love that look we're not in this uh standard of love you know what I'm saying concerning that the world is you know they they don't like this person they don't like that person um they don't like these I don't like like the black people don't like the white people the white people don't like the black people you know what I'm saying and other stuff you know it's a lot of uh, tension going on at a lot of places, and and the 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 response that I see in most Christians on Facebook uh, that that says they are Christians, I'm hearing comments about a lot of things, and I, and their comments is not about the ideal of loving people. You know, it's not this kind of defined love comments towards uh towards the issues that are going on around I guess America I guess um that we I'm, I'm not well I do see some that speak you know speaks against you know uh, uh the ideals of the racial tensions and hating our president and, you know it's a whole lot of stuff going on I see and people that are Christians are like you know, that says, oh, you know, uh, we don't like this person. We don't like that person. This person is this. And I'm like, what the heck? You know, where is the um, first Corinthians um, at 13 and 4 through 8 love? You know, where's the Matthews 5 and 4 and 4 love? You know what I'm saying? Uh, love your enemies. Bless those that curse you. Pray for them that spitefully use you. Where is this God's love performance that, you know, we should understand that we should uh, come to perform, you know, and and shine a light to be an example to the issues that are going on around the country uh, uh, concerning these, like, you know, people don't like Donald Trump and they think he's a bad person to the racial tensions of you know, this and what happened, I guess, in Rowak, uh, uh, Virginia, or something like that. You know, where is our light that shows that no, we stand on the side of love, of we we are about God's love performance and speaking out that you know of of the ideal of forgiveness, forgiving people for that has done us wrong, and how much we. Uh, truly want uh, operate in the love of God there that we want to show an example to other people that are out there you know what I'm saying that is you know thinking that you shouldn't 
uh, that is of the world standard will agreeing with these um, tensions, negative attentions towards uh, Donald Trump or the race wars and whatever crazy things that are happening. Um, where is these Christians that are, you know, shining a light of God's love towards this situation to tell them that this is the principle that we should be following concerning if we have God's love inside our hearts, we should be performing this concerning what's going on in the world because it's like it's not good that people are that say as Christians are saying that they don't like this person, they don't like Donald Trump, they don't like this racist people, they don't like this and that and this. And it's just crazy how bad that is going on in the uh, world that we need to be a light. We must say, no, I love my enemies. I bless those that curse you. I pray for them that despitefully use you. This is what I do concerning my God in heaven, my Father God in heaven. I am of this agenda. You know what I'm saying? That And, and if those that are of God, we will be about speaking about those agendas, I mean, about those issues that are going on in the world and how much God's love we supposed to be operating in. You know what I'm saying? And in my other me monster video, I was talking about that we supposed to be on so much of a love agenda that we we think about trying to give ideas and reasons to show love to people we will run and cross. You know what I'm saying? That we will be like, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to say I love you to this person. I'm going to give this person a hug. I'm going to, uh, uh, you know, uh, do this for this person. I'm going to do this. I'm going to try to do this and that for these people. We're supposed to have a strong love agenda. You know what I'm saying? Concerning our performances when we go, wherever we go, we're supposed to be planning, have a, I mean, even planning out to see if you know what this person doing concerning school or a job or whatever, you know what I'm saying? You're going to plan on doing this, you know, when you come across this person or or this and that. You know, we we supposed to be bold with our God's love. You know what I'm saying? We're supposed to show a boldness in our love that that the world will say, whoa, this is, the you, you do not have my our definition of love you have the definition of god's love you know what i'm saying people are supposed to distinguish our love towards the things of this world but if we are like being like the world and being about like not liking not liking our president or not liking another race or not you know other stuff that is not a reflection of a true representation of God's love towards one another. You know what I'm saying? And it, we need to be, if we truly of God, if we true a child of God, it says in Matthews 4 and 5 and 4, I mean 4 and 45, he says we are the children of God if we perform this love. You know, our enemies bless us that curse you, pray for them, that's why we use it. We are a child of God. We supposed to be making the defense stance on God's love best way as possible. Showing videos, showing, talking about how much we love this, how much we love that. We should be uh, making any kind of uh, uh, things, videos of interaction with ra racial wars or something, loving other, you know, Loving the cops, you know what I'm saying? Loving, you know, uh, uh, caring about the president of the United States. You know what I'm saying? We should show forth the love that where we stand at. We love one another, period, point blank. We're not going to do the opposite of what the world does and, you know, show negativity to whoever. And uh, we're not on that because we are God's. We got God's love inside our hearts. And that's not what... What we do is what people should, that are true Christians, make a definitive stance 
on your love of God performance is what I'm saying. All right, that's the message. Hope we got it. To God be the glory. And for around in Jesus' name, amen.